Hi, I'm Garvin. Welcome to our telehealth video series. In this video, we'll give a brief overview of what you need to know about bronchitis. In particular, I will cover what bronchitis is, how you treat bronchitis, and how you can better live with bronchitis. So to start with, what is bronchitis? Bronchitis is an inflammation of the lining of your bronchial tubes. And bronchial tubes carry air to and from your lungs. Bronchitis may be either acute or chronic. So it's a common condition and acute bronchitis often develops from a cold or other respiratory infection. Chronic bronchitis is a more serious condition and is a constant irritation or inflammation of the lining of the bronchial tubes and it's often due to smoking cigarettes. Acute bronchitis usually improves within a few days without lasting effects, although you may continue to cough for weeks. However, if you have repeated bouts of bronchitis, you may have chronic bronchitis, which requires medical attention. So next, what are the symptoms? For either acute bronchitis or chronic bronchitis, the signs and symptoms include a cough, production of mucus, either clear or white, shortness of breath and made worse by mild exertion, wheezing, fatigue, slight fever and chills and chest discomfort. If you have acute bronchitis, you may have a nagging cough that lingers for several weeks after bronchitis resolves. However, bronchitis symptoms can be deceptive. You don't always produce sputum when you have bronchitis and children often swallow coughed up sputum so parents may not know there's a secondary infection. Symptoms of chronic bronchitis would be, so if you have chronic bronchitis, long-term inflammation leads to scarring of the bronchial tubes, producing excessive mucus. Over time, the lining of the bronchial tubes thickens and your airways eventually may become scarred. So the symptoms of chronic bronchitis include a cough that's worse in the mornings and in damp weather, frequent respiratory infections such as colds or flu, with a worsening productive cough. And if you have chronic bronchitis, you're likely to have periods when your signs and symptoms worsen. At those times, you may have superimposed acute bronchitis, either viral or bacterial, in addition to chronic bronchitis. So what are the causes of each? For acute bronchitis, the same viruses that cause colds often cause acute bronchitis. But you can also develop non-infectious bronchitis from exposure to your own or someone else's tobacco smoke and from pollutants such as household cleaners and smog. And for chronic bronchitis, sometimes inflammation and thickening of the lining of the bronchial tubes becomes a permanent and a condition known as chronic bronchitis. You're generally considered to have chronic bronchitis if you cough most days for at least three months a year in two consecutive years. So next is how do you treat bronchitis? So antibiotics, bronchitis usually results from a viral infection so antibiotics aren't effective. However, your doctor may prescribe an antibiotic if they suspect that you have a bacterial infection. If you have chronic lung disorder, or if you smoke, your doctor may also prescribe antibiotics to reduce your risk of a serious secondary infection. There's cough medicines. So it's best not to suppress a cough that brings up mucus because coughing helps remove irritants from the lungs and air passages. If your cough keeps you up from sleep or keeps you from sleeping, use enough OTC cough medicine so that you can rest, but not enough to suppress your cough completely. Other medications. So if you have asthma or chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, your doctor may recommend an inhaler and other medication to reduce inflammation and open narrowed passages in your lungs. And finally, how do you live with bronchitis? So besides the basic treatments of rest and plenty of liquids and over-the-counter cough medicines, the following suggestions can help make you more comfortable and a speedy recovery and prevent complications of acute bronchitis and help control the symptoms of chronic bronchitis. First, avoid exposure to irritants such as tobacco smoke. So don't smoke and wear a mask when the air is polluted 
or if you're exposed to irritants such as paint or household cleaners with strong fumes. Use a humidifier in your room. Warm, moist air helps relieve coughs and loosens mucus in the airways. Use over-the-counter medications to relieve pain and lower a high fever. Paracetamol and ibuprofen <coughs> excuse me, may help. Next, you could try pursed lip breathing. If you have chronic bronchitis, you may breathe too fast. Pursed lip breathing helps slow your breathing and may make you feel better. So finally, before I finish, there are numerous products available at Lynch's Pharmacy in Douglas to assist in managing bronchitis more effectively. To start with, we have numerous products available to get you started on a gentle exercise program. So we have exercise balls, floor mats, weights and various equipment required for an exercise program. We also have various supplements which you can purchase from us without a prescription such as echinacea, vitamin C and over-the-counter cough medicine and pain relievers. So that brings this video to an end. Customers of Lynch's Pharmacy can avail of a brand new service at Telehealth Clinic. You can book a 30 minute clinic at our pharmacy in order to increase your understanding of your illness. During this clinic, we create a cohesive management plan which enables you to take a more active role in managing bronchitis with confidence. So call into us at Lynch's Pharmacy in Douglas in Cork or call 021 436 6923 to find out more. Thank you for watching. Stay healthy and stay informed.